Welcome back guys, this is part 3 of this 3 part Google Maps challenge that I'm doing in Myrtle Beach. Um, I made it back home, uh, I'm actually about to go film a video, but this is part 3. Um, this pond is actually, I found it on Google Maps, in the back of our condo complex that we were staying in. This is a private area, so I'm not going to, because in my past two parts I've shown like screen recording from my phone, but I'm not going to go ahead and do that just because I want to keep this private and I don't want anyone trying to sneak on his property and get in trouble. It's just right out of our back door pretty much. I hope that you guys enjoyed this series. I know just putting a little twist on my videos, uh, this was a lot of fun to do. And using good tools like Google Maps on my phone to find some place to fish and all that. Uh, I came across some awesome new species, some good fishing. It just all around a good time so I hope you guys enjoy this series a lot uh, let me know if you guys want to see more series like this one uh, of course we probably can't go down to Myrtle Beach and all uh, but just let me know any challenges like this I'll probably end up doing some more Google Maps challenges because this was a lot of fun um, but that pretty much wraps up this intro I don't have much more to say this was a lot of fun fishing here and there are some good fish in there so we're gonna get right into this video hope you guys enjoy it see you guys in the next video Nice bass. There's one. It's that. Oh, it's a bass. Oh, wow. I sight fished this one. I thought it might have been like a giant bluegill. The way I could see him. Let's freaking go. Oh, no. Come on. First bass on the morning, literally got out of bed. There's another bass. Oh my gosh. That's just awesome. I've been recording for like literally a minute and a half. Ah, he's biting me, he's ready to go. Let's freaking go, dude. First bass on the day. I'm on these bluegill beds. I thought that there might have been a big ploppy on the water. Uh, and then I just see. I get bit and then there's a bass. Not a bad one to start off the day either. Just throwing this Texas rig, four inch crawl, natural color. Let's get that out there. Let's give this moving bigger try. That's what I caught. I got a few bites on this moving bait. Last time I was found last night. There we go. There's one. First cast with the crankbait. Little guy. About the same size as the first one I caught. Man, these fish crush this crankbait too. These hooks are always so hard to get out whenever they get hooked like this. Right. Fish number two on a day. Another one from that fountain over there. There we go. 
Alright, first cast off this pipe. Oh, I thought it was a lot bigger at first. On that crawl again. There's a pipe right out there. He ate it on the way down. He was so aggressive at it. Whew. Probably could have used that meal too. Not a bad fish though. I mean, nothing great, but you know. Nice little squeaker to add to the board. No way. I have my frog on. I didn't even try to catch it. I didn't even cast at the frog. I didn't mean to. Look at that. Oh my gosh. We're back at it probably for our last go. We have probably 15 minutes to fish. Oh my gosh, I really thought I had something big. Oh, I think I had something. Wow, that scared me. There's something. There we go. Well, that's a saw bass. He came up and got it. Let's freaking go. Come on, buddy. Just stop. Second cast. Not a bad fish. Let's go. Wow, that is a beauty. Let's get him back. He was right over here. What a beauty. Last minute out here. Leave South Carolina tomorrow morning. Could be just our last South Carolina fish. Let's go. That's a freaking tank. That's a freaking tank. That's like four. Nah, that's like a three. You probably can't even see me. I mean, it's not giant, but that's probably our last fish ever in South Carolina for this year. Oh my goodness. Let me put the flash on if I can. Probably about a three. Holy cow. Man, that is awesome. He came up after it on that bandito bug. There's one. What a tank. Oh my gosh, this is bigger. Holy crap, guys. This is all you can see of the fish, probably. GoPro footage was completely trash look at that bass dude oh my goodness biggest ones we've caught out of here out of all the time that we've been fishing it this is our final fish of the myrtle beach blue maps fishing challenge sorry there's a frog